Terry Caliendo of Dedicated Managers here again. And in the previous video, I talked about this new project that I'm working on or that I just finished, and then I'm gonna try and recreate and show how I did all the steps in all the different pieces. It's a, a very simple website with some very custom backend um, functionality as far as the schedule and newsletter goes and how they work together through custom post types and uh, you know database programming and whatnot. So I'll get into that later, but right now I want to talk about the front end builder that I use to visually des design this website, and that is Oxygen. Um, Oxygen is a powerful visual site builder for WordPress. That is not a lie. It's, uh, it, I believe it is the most flexible. It's pretty awesome. I have no ties to Oxygen financially because they do not have an affiliate program. So uh, you might not see... Um, as many reviews about Oxygen because they are not, they don't have an affiliate program. So no, there's no reason for anybody to, to promote them. Uh, but also the, the upside is there's no reason for anybody to lie about how good they are. And I think uh, this tool is absolutely fantastic. And uh, you know, before I found Oxygen, I hated working with WordPress because I just did not understand its theming system. Um, I get what its theme is, but I would go and, you know, if I had a project come in, you'd go and try and find a theme you had two choices. You could build a theme or find a theme that closely fit and then modify what you were trying to, to do. But those modifications to, you know, just move something, um, move some text around or add some extra spacing just took, I mean, it was a half hour, 45 minutes sometimes, sometimes two hours just to find the weird piece of code, what they were doing in CSS to override it um, because they were doing goofy, important stuff that they shouldn't have been doing with their CSS. So, um, I always hated working with um, with WordPress for that reason, is I couldn't stand the front end layout. It was just such a pain to work with. And if you didn't want to use somebody else's theme, you'd have to go and build your own theme. And uh, to build your own theme, you have to understand this picture here. This is the you know the WordPress um, temp template hierarchy. And um, oops, I didn't want to do that. Um, so this is their you know this is the theme. And and if you if you create a theme, you have to understand how to create all these different, um, you know, pages uh, and, and get them to work together and what overrides what. And it's just, it's just super confusing to me. I've never taken the time to learn about it. I've never wanted to because it's just been such a pain. Because even if I did learn this, I still have to hand code, you know, the front visual end. It's not drag and drop and it's not, you know, it's not, you're not visually designing like you would if you were working in uh, Photoshop or something. So, and if you did want to make something nice, you'd go and make it in Photoshop, and then you'd try and mimic that in code, and it was just super pain. So, Oxygen stops all of that. Op Oxygen brings a amazing builder, um, you know, drag and drop type deal that allows you to visually design, and uh, it's got, it's just, you don't have to think about any of this. It's just got a catch-all template that you can use that catches everything, so anything that's not built, it'll, it'll catch where it needs to go. So... Um, it's really changed my outlook on Oxygen, and I've really delved into or on, on on WordPress, and it's forced me to delve into using WordPress to the point where I've started coding, and that's where I started coding the schedule and the newsletter with custom functionality, um, because that stuff is easy. Creating plugins is actually very easy. Uh, it's just a matter of creating a file and a folder in the plugin directory, and now you've got a plugin, and then you just learn all the different calls you need to make. Um, but really, as far as the design goes, I mean, Oxygen is, um, I'll show in the next video where I start building out the, um, the templates uh, in Oxygen. You'll see amaz how amazingly simple it is to just simply, if I, if I didn't like the way these were spaced, I could add a little extra space in here. If I wanted space between these icons and this name here, I could easily add it at, with a click of a button or, or create this, make this text size bigger. Whatever I need to do, it's visually there. It's all got all the power of all CSS and, and everything you could ever need. It's got the DOM, the DOM structure, and you can easily move elements around. If I wanted this below this, it's just a matter of going to the, the DOM panel and, and moving it, which I'll show in, a, in, a, in the next videos or subsequent videos. So anyway, um, I just wanted to give my reasons for why I love Oxygen and why it's, it's brought a newfound love for me of, um, of WordPress. And, um, and and how I'm going to start using WordPress a lot more going forward because of it. I'm sure there's a lot of competitors out there to Oxygen. I've tried a bunch of them, and nothing. I haven't seen found anything that has the um, the capabilities that Oxygen has. I mean, you can even they, you can even they 
allow you to put in a code block and even in, you know uh, introduce code into specific parts of pages or make function calls from from specific parts of pages. So um, I haven't seen anything with the ability that that Oxygen has. Uh, it's a little bit cumbersome maybe for people to get started with if you're not strong in CSS. Uh, but it's a great way to learn CSS because of the um, the tools it has, it, you're directly manipulating CSS properties so you can see all the CSS properties that are available to a certain element. Um, and I'll get into that deeper in, um, in other videos. So anyway, Terry Caliendo, Dedicated Managers. Uh, here is our YouTube channel, uh, Dedicated Managers. Looking for subscribers. If you like this type of content, please subscribe so that you get a notification. Hoping to come out with videos on a more routine schedule. Um, and if you haven't checked out our playlists, uh, previously, I did 53 videos. Uh, I went on a rampage on um, creating a real-time database with uh, Vue, Vue.js uh, and, and, and Google's Firebase Firestore. So that's something to check out if you're interested in programming. Um, JavaScript on the front end, uh, you know, single page web applications. Uh, amazing stuff there. So. And then uh, here's to contact us. This is Dedicated Managers. This is uh, the website. If you need to get a hold of us or you have a project that you need some help with uh, or any issues, um, we, we handle all kinds of, of hardware, software, internet presence needs. Um, feel free to contact us right here at DedicatedManagers.com. All right, Terry Caliendo, thanks for listening. Signing off. Have a great day and happy coding.